Evening everyone, how are we all doing tonight? Welcome along, cattle and crops again tonight. Hey, without Dal at Milton. Microphone activated. Let's bring you two back in, because I've probably got you a bit worried after that symbol, Milton. <laughs> <laughs> As to what I might be up to. Yeah. Nightbot can't get you. No. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I done it. <laughs> no, Nightbot can't get you for it. But you can. Oh, yes. Yeah. I knew it. I blame Dal for that. But that's another conversation for another day. <laughs> I didn't go to. I didn't go over the tunnel. Not <laughs> even looked without seeing that yet. So we have a new DLC out, do we? For the, for the league. Yeah. So what exactly does this DLC consist of then? I don't know. Uh, I might go have a look at it in a minute. It is free? Yeah, it's free. Yeah, I will have a look at it. We'll do the competition in it, the league. Yeah. Uh, what we're going to do on here tonight is a bit of a free play, but before we can do that... I see you without. So it'd have to go on something like my um, Nitrado server, etc. for us to be able to make use of it then. Mm. Oh, that's a bit daft. Yeah. Right. As we're going to switch to free play on here tonight, we have got to do one quest first. Have a look through into this. So to be able to actually make use of the farmyard, we've got to take the first quest on to get it. If we look in here, if we want to make use of the farm, we need to actually do the start your career quest. But that will be the only one we take on which would give us the farm uh, some machine which we can swap out and will swap out if need be for some bigger stuff that will give us the two tractors, a cultivator which we will get rid of for a bigger one um, the f wagon we'll need and we will want a bigger plough that also gives us fields 14, 16, 15, 13, 48, 36, 28 and 3 which is worth having because having looked at what fields we've got field 3 is nearly 5 hectares that's quite a nice big field down there hey Paul, yeah we're gonna take on the um, free ones but before we can do that we'll just take this first one on so we get the farmyard which means we need to just find the MB track and then we'll sell some of that off and that's all we're going to do in the way of quests now everything else will be up to us to get on and farm as we see fit on here so we need to just find the MB track past the hovering Volkswagen <laughs> just find it weird how the wheels sort of um, appear afterwards just remember I'm on cattle and crops again not FS and I can't walk with a joystick on here Just wait for the MB to arrive at our location. It will run us down if we get in the way. So we now just need to wait for the MB track. We'll enter it once he's out of it. So 
we'll now uh, just carry out the rest of this quest because we do need that feeder wagon you can't go 100% quest free in the game or you can can't do free play, the quests are still there but you don't have to take them, you can just do what you like basically. What can they go? So this is that what we're gonna do. I think we'll have to keep an MB track in the farm though somehow. Mainly because they sound nice. This will be the one and only quest we take on. Give us a chance to try some bigger kit out now. <clears throat> Some nice big tractors in here we can have a go with. So what tractors do you guys think we ought to get? The um, Axions or the big Deutz tractor? Deutz. And that was the one I was sort of leaning towards. Having a look at. rid of the dodgy mod I knew about in the mod folder for this. So that's gone. I so hope that won't cause us any issues. Thing we're keeping on in that quest box is when the animals need feeding. So this can stay here. We'll have a look at what machine we've got and what we want to change. remember what key does what again because I was doing FS a little while ago for tomorrow's video evening 1174 how are we doing right so let's have a look through the machinery now and see what we can sell we've got to attach that actually before we can finish there we go So we're not going to do the uh, mission up there for now. All good, thanks. So that one is slurry on one of our fields. Isn't that bit we actually need the reputation at to begin with? So things that we own. Well, that cultivator can definitely go. That plough can go because we want a bigger one. Um, tractor and loader will have to keep because that's the only loader tractor in the game, I believe. So do we keep the MB track as well? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. And just get a bigger tractor to go with them. 
Okay. So we're allowed to have 15 machines by the looks of it. So what we'll just do, as we don't seem to have very much money to buy things with, we might just have to give a little um, bit of a kick to the bank account, shall we say. Well, it's that easy to put £10 million pounds in your own bank account. So, evening GD, how are we doing? I hope Minnie's feeling better now. Oh, that would be the wrong button. Let's go with this one. There are some mods in here, um, Paul. It's actually one of the mods I was going to take a look at for our plow. So we want a nice big tractor, which would be that one. 238. I've been there for to do what we want to do. So we'll have that. We might have to get rid of the MB track, I don't know yet. There's a few Cavernland mods in here. Um, may need a front weight at some point. It's plows we're looking for. So we've got the in-game ones here. Which we can go up to... A 6 plus 1, so 7 furrow. If needs be. Or we've got the modded ones here, which are six furrows. And we've got one which come with a packer. Which I think would be one to have a look at somehow. As it's a mod. Ah. Usually helps to feel better then. So we'll have a look at this one as a mod. If it's a load of junk, we'll um, swap it for an in-game one. That's the play we want to have a look at before we do anything else. And I'm guessing if we're getting a big player, we better find the front weight. We know the hammer one is up there. And what other front weights we've got in here? We can <clears throat> lease machinery as well. So we would need to put some slurry on the fields. So we're stuck with the hammer front white. Do I think we want a 4,000 kilo front white somehow, but a 2,000 one would probably do for the um, tractors. Keep on our machines up there though. So. I think we need to head down and have a look at our new purchase. Alright, so let's have a look at this plow and see what their textures are actually like. So, hexagonal press rings. Not too bad, but we'll see how it goes on the tractor. The front weight is spawned in an interesting place. Hey SG, how are we doing? So better go outside for this much so I don't clobber the front weight. I'm good, thanks. It's 
So we have a front weight now, that's one good thing. So I think we may need it with this thing. That doesn't lift very high. You better just check that turns over okay. Not really. Interesting. So that is a mod as I said. I think we'll take that off and have a look at the in-game one. To see if it behaves better. I think we better just uh, turn that back the other way first. Have a look what the in-game one's like, whether that picks up any better. It's not the biggest player we can lay our hands on. So if we go for the seven farrow, we'll just buy that. We can always sell one. It's got to be one which actually picks up and does what it should, should do. Yeah, that looks a bit better. So whilst that mod is nice, it sort of... Um, doesn't do what we need it to unfortunately so we'll sell that again so we can now head up to our fields this out. Make sure we get the right fields obviously. Not going to play with someone else's field do we? So we'll probably have to lease some machinery to be able to keep to actually owning what we need. Hi Crazy Chicken, how are we doing? We know this one in here is ours. Not bad at all here, thanks. How you gone to date? Quick on that four for our play we used last time. We can hire an employee if needs be as well.
head in cab. Does sound nice. Do these tractor sounds in FS really? field plowed and we'll <clears throat> see about putting a helper on the job and see what happens there. Brave of me after last night and that Only one person knows my true comments about the stream last night after and what went wrong, don't you Milton? <laughs> yes. Very nice. Nice choice of words. Yeah. Wasn't too worried about crashing last night, as you've got to expect that with the game at the moment. Um, are we talking real life or in this game, Crazy Chicken? That's a tough one. <clears throat> Bit of a fan of the Case Pumas and modern tractors. That's what the last one was that I had new when I was still on the farm. Tractors, though, that'd have to be Fords. There's a surprise, Paul. Twitch has a habit of going funny on my streams. Usually, if you refresh, though, it comes back. Quite know what's going on with it. Getting to the point where I may abandon Twitch again. Just going to keep playing up for people. Just go back to YouTube only. Big fields of field three to play, which would be the one we'll probably try a help run. Of course, if the track were to move, it'd be a good start. Certainly, R1174, really good sounds in there. 
Oh, I've had that error warner before when I've been watching GD on there, Paul. Refreshed a couple of times, that's gone away. play both of them, cries chicken, no preference over either or. We will go back to FS19 in the stream again. This isn't a permanent arrangement. Seems to put itself into manual gearbox mode at the minute. Didn't like that gear. So you can quite easily bury the tractor, especially if you press the stop engine button when you're plowing. It ain't just the outside sounds they got right, it's the sounds inside. field done. We've got a little field next door and what we'll do is put a helper onto that if we can, just see what it does. I shall be brave and try one again. See what all these notifications are, what were coming up before I hit the HUDs on here. Just to share physics, how this working is a lot better. Well, I was well aware of the D-Day bit, but uh, happy birthday, Nathaniel. says one good thing with cattle and crops there's no vultures in the game boys we shall be testing the ponds out on there any vulture people lurking <laughs> one by test isn't it? yeah
I'm good, thanks, Nathaniel. How are you? I'm actually tempted to get rid of RMB track at the moment. If it'll pull the drill, we'll keep it. If not, we'll have to swap it for the bigger MB track. We also need slurry on, so we'll have to look at that one. That's one field plowed. So let's have a look at which other ones we actually own here. Let's get that back up. We got six notifications now. Nothing too major up there. So let's have a look here and see what we've got so owned fields field three is the biggest we've just ploughed field 15 100% plowed. Fairly dry. Field 13 is sowed. Okay. This is 100% sowed. So this is field 3. So we'll set this off on field 3, I think, as that's a nice big one. We have got other fields around the yard we can buy, like. Um, let's go to available, it's easier. So we can't buy that one, we need reputation from the biogas plant and that one. There's some you can buy and some you can't. So that one we could. Just looking through and see which ones are actually available to buy without having to use the biogas plant. Field 12. See, 4.82 hectares, 86,000 euros. They're a lot cheaper than the farm sim fields. Let's see if we got anything close by to where we are. There's lots of fields there, but that's the sizes of them where they are. We also need some which obviously need sewage plant reputation. Some need the cooperative reputation. 
In other words, if you don't do the quests, there's some fields you can't buy. So it's quite limited with some of them. In other words, you're stuck with doing um, contracts for some of them. Alright, let's head down to field 3 then. Then we go get a helper on this. See if we can remember the way to field three. Probably means we're about to get completely and utterly lost going to field three, you realise? about doing some slurry as well. So we'll have to come down here and buy some. Yep, so that's this one here. Now... Handbrake. <clears throat> Soon let you know if you forget the handbrake anyway. See what we can do about helpers. Right, back in a bit guys. Okay. Okay. Somewhere in here are employees. Hmm. Do we employ a woman driver? Do we assign employees then? Let's have a look.
So he's got a way of assigning the employee to what we're doing. Otherwise we'll sack him again. Good boss like they, they do what I want or they're sacked. You use your good at working this sort of thing out, Milton. What? How do we assign employees in this game? No, oh, I don't know. Oh, let me down. <laughs> Wait a minute. Really want the employee to play with this field if we can. Get help to go, and we'll uh, get on with another job then. There's plenty of other jobs to get on with at the moment on there. Did you find your way? I stopped looking at the moment. Yeah, I can. I can't find anything. Mm. Wonder if that bit's not quite finished yet. Yeah, that's what I'm Can't hire him, we aren't gonna pay him, basically. Next one, Farmer Dodd. I'll have my own one coming out, but I won't be in the next one. So I wasn't on there when they're recording this week. It's a bit late for me this week. Can't do anything like a sign of help to lose jobs, can we? can't find anything. No, we'll have to do a bit of research after the stream, I think. Yeah. So I'm afraid our man is um, gone. So we will stop that tractor there, and we'll go and do another job rather than keep doing this all stream. I think we can find some slurry to put on. So we'll just head in and stop that one. And put the handbrake on, because we know what happened last night on this field. 
handbrake actually moves as well on the side console there. We want the MB track. Of course. to the trader and uh, go find a slurry tanker. So this is the 1400, there is an 1800 as well. Do we swap the 14 for an 18? Hundred and forty horsepower against hundred and eighty. Okay, Farmer Dodd. So we'll try leasing the slurry tanker. So I think you have to lease it for a set period. Ah, F3 for worker, is it? Thank you, Paul. Let's try horror on one again and we'll see then. We'll try hiring him again. One hour, two hours. Hire him for 12 hours, shall we? Let's see what happens. <clears throat> So how are you supposed to, um, interesting, hire the worker then, Paul, she obviously just done a bit of research on it. Press F3 in the track and nothing happens. Press F3 out of the track and nothing happens, so um not seeing any uh Sign of hiring a worker at the moment, Paul. Okay. The forums where I was reading now, people say that it crashed their game. Right, okay. We won't hire a worker then if it's going to crash a game. We had enough of that last night. <laughs> yeah, they were saying that uh, the hired worker was crashing their game. Right, that's a good enough reason for me not to I hire one. Yeah, but it was old posts. But I don't know if they had fixed it or not.
Right, tasks tab, okay. Crashes the game at the moment, we're not exactly lost a yeah. great amount, but what I will do is save it. We might as well take every precaution. Right. So let's go up here. Tasks. Ah, I see. Okay, Dal. Okay, thanks. Right, we'll save that as stay in this field after finished. Keep vehicle combination. Well, as the tractor's moving, I guess we've got a help of some description on board. Um, okay. We've definitely got a helper, but, uh, yeah. It's not letting us restart the work. Okay. So it looks like the helpers we hire are as good as the ones what we actually um had last night. Set him off up this end and see what he does this time. Just in case he's getting confused by anything. I've got a bad feeling about this. We'll just slowly follow him and see what he's up to. Okay. 
Okay. So we can't use a help link because they're as useless as the ones we had last night. So we'll stop this again. We'll go back to what we were going to do. Which is hire the slurry tanker and do some slurry. See what slurry tankers are in here. I say at the minute we've got the 140 MB. Somewhere in here are the MB tracks. So we've got the 1000, 1400, and the 1800. I think we're going to swap up for the big boy there. And we'll sell the one we've got. Now we'll look at a slurry tank. I think we've only got the one in here. Which are these two. We'll rent them for 24 hours. Should have a nice big MB track sitting here now. Have more horsepower than we need, really. Something I did notice in this one, I was moved about is the pedals move in this one. Sure, we've got plenty of power for this thing this time. A little class was struggling a bit with this on them fields. Quite sure why this won't stay going backwards, but we shall find out. Thanks for the sub, Leonardo. Don't think I could have put that in a much worse place to try and back this into when that spawned. We'll go find some slurry now.
could have some fun with this because it doesn't seem to want to steer very well. Plus we could get lost off on the um, slurry plant from this direction. Just add to the fun. Just wonder if that thing needs a front weight on it. Might borrow the one off the door, it's just to try that. MP track really don't like this tanker, which is surprising. If we put bigger MP track on it than the class is, and it will not be pull up. Good thing what's going to happen when you put something in it with how that's behaving. So I can't even stare at it at the minute. I think we might have to go and borrow the Deutz for this. Well, there's definitely no collisions on the gates there. We just tested that one out. Front wheels aren't on the ground, that ain't gonna help matters. Okay, Paul. Will do. Thanks. I'll have to drop the plow here for now. No way we can use that MB track on that slurry tank, hey, that's about even. And B track will have to find itself another job to do.
Let's try it with a bigger tractor. See if this handles it a bit better, shall we? That looks better. Just got to hope it works when we get to the field. Right, let's see if we can remember how to unfold this thing. Some of this lovely stuff on these fields. We have a better light to see it in this time than when we were doing it the other night on here. On that other field, in the dark. I think I'm actually working at a contractor tomorrow who um, runs a Holmer. Terravarian.
This field can then be drilled with something. Probably something that can be done with a combo in this time. What doesn't involve helpers and soilage trailers? What you sort of said, Milt, about help us crash the game would make sense to last night, though. Yeah. I mean, that crashed all those helpers involved in silage. Keep in mind that uh, the game it is in devil. devil yeah. yeah. They are still tweaking a lot of things. Exactly, that's why it's. No good getting upset if things like that happen. It nope. even says on the game early access when you order it, so um, you got to expect it. Hence, if we lost hours and hours of work or anything last night. feeling that might happen, Dal. What you sent me? Oh, right, yeah. Just want to let you know. Yeah. We need this slurry texture in FS. This tractor is actually working with manual gear change and the shifter for changing direction. That's the only one that has done so far. half a tank, not even that. But we'll go and refill it before we go on to the next field. So we're near the surge works at the minute. Back up. Fold it. Well, let's fold and we'll have a look at our field tasks. So we're currently on that one, whichever one it is. Field 48. Wetness 81%. That might be some do that amount of fertilizer we just chucked on it. I think we've got a bit of a typo with the coming soon down there as well.
Okay, GD. Welcome back. That bounces quite nicely down the road. Manual gear change can take a bit getting used to though. Certainly was GD. Must have been watching that horse you ride the other month when its head started twerking. Certainly seems to have done, GD. Can't find to get the helpers to do what you want them to. Trying to shift fairly. Um, that'd be my doing because I can. You can zoom in and out where you want in here, GD. That's me who zoomed it back. So you could be sitting right there if we want to. Fields on the left, there we'll be doing. What happens when I watch you too much, GD? Everything becomes my fault. on this one. I've been bracing things being my fault for years GD.
At least we know we've got slurry on our fields now. Of a wet patch there, hope we don't get stuck. We've got the field we ploughed a little while ago over there as well. Our dog is about to get um, slurried. Nope. Our dog nearly got run over. It's definitely good to get a slurry bath. <coughs> no, it's not. It's indestructible. <laughs> it's tra the slurry tank is dragging the dog <laughs> along, along sideways. <laughs> oh, Lord. Interesting dog. Hey, doggy, doggy, doggy. Nothing to see here at all. I am not dragging the dog along sideways with a slurry tanker. <laughs> Milk. Optical illusion. <laughs> the dogs just look around and think, well, what was that? <laughs> Let's fold the tanker up and get around the dog with it. Don't get me started on what I think of them, GD. Do I think this one will take long to do somehow? This feels nice and dry. Hardly leaving a mark on it. This ploughed field. Fields are something more solid to drive on than what the um, colour bowed ones are.
so he's starting to look wet way over the lap done. I think I have enough in here to do all our fields up this way. These fields are a lot drier than the other ones. puddle on here unlike the other ones we've done. So no soil moisture is a thing in this game. Gives us a few fields we get on to drill now anyway. Certainly see the overlap now on these ones. Got twelve. Um, Notifications up there at the minute. Does that fit between them two trees? If not, we'll make it fit. Slurry up the yard, we shall see. Just a try there before we go elsewhere to get any more. Pause is pretty terrifying when that auto saves. It's made you feel like it might not come back. enough to finish this field somehow. Let's see if there's anything in our tank though. Mm -hmm. Just 
doesn't look like it. Go back and get some more from the shop if that's the case. Something else this game comes with is actually decent sounding horns on the tractors. fields we haven't done now. track and manage the drill this time around. Quick enough to outrun this tractor. It's trying its hardest to. Fairly cheap anyway, slurry. I think good run out in the holding tank looking at her. I think nine pound a thousand litres. Or nine euros rather. to watch the twerking tanker again. up some serious XP points at the minute. Actually that's what most of that 14 is up in that top corner.
that just leaves us field three. Or what is a grass anyway? Right, <clears throat> that leaves some drilling now. Lord knows what that dog has got to. On there. Last seen in this direction. After having a slurry shower. Still in this direction. I think it's a bit confused as to how it got there when it was in the field last time it knew. Got quite a nice look to it, the dog in this anyway. A bit of weird fur going on here and there, but there. We want this one, and we also will go to the vehicle trader with it. See if it behaves itself this time. the drill better than the hand of the slurry tanker. If not I'll have to go. This is the biggest MB track, yeah it's not got as much go in it as the small one had. This thing's gonna have to disappear. Hi Tom, how are you doing? This is hopeless, this MB track. Compared to that little one. That's always worth doing. Don't catch anything nasty off them. This is going. Continually struggling, doesn't even sound like it's doing things properly. I 
Our dog enjoys itself then. Get rid of that one. So you need a tractor to replace it with. See how much horsepower the drill. I think we'll lease the drill the same way we leased other bits and pieces. So it is the hammer drill. Don't know if we need to do a subsoil or anything, because I think there are some in here. <coughs> so secondary cultivations. here which is the um, modded one we've got it's a bit slow just wonder whether you try a mod drill out once the game is saved here somewhere I saw it. There, Mini Air Nova. Fieldwork and missing. Okay. Don't think we'll lease something what says missing as a characteristic. A big set of discs here. We're stuck with the hammer one at the moment. Okay, we'll rent it. He's 150 horsepower, so I was wondering the class was even pulling it before. Look at that horsepower, I think we're going to need another bigger tractor. big enough now that's some nice spawning how they've come about If we can pick that up with the tractor and move it, or else we could have a problem. Yes, we can, luckily. I 
Yeah, I did have a look at it earlier, Tom. Be a first look video coming out tomorrow morning on it. I think this is going to struggle this drill somehow. Let's see what um, grain crops we can actually drill. No, I haven't, Tom. I haven't had a chance to yet. I will have a look at it. got 18 notifications up there does power slide nicely this thing just have a little trap around the housing estate whilst I try and find the cooperative That's a dead end there. Yeah, that power ridge is by the same person who done the Grimmy GT in 17. Which could be worth watching. That's a dead end as well. Literally. Horses there. Yeah, 76 Max is the one that done the um, GT. Which bodes well. Just have a little ride round and look around the area. Pretend I'm not lost. No idea on that one, Tom. Managed probably more hard work than what they th were expecting. Let's see what seed we can put in this. What have we got? Barley, wheat, or rye? Let's do some. We temporary, temporarily misplaced, I think, is the phrase, Tom. Temporarily misplaced with a lack of precision.
Yeah, especially when we had it as a extra fruit on some maps in um, 17 and already some in 19. Roy was on. It was certainly on the NF Marsh map I'd done on live streams. The AI cars have got two choices, they either stop at a junction or take them out. And you can take them out quite nicely with a tractor on there. Who knows? Don't even know what they're gonna do yet. Yeah, usually is Tom. It'd be disappointed if they find out the uh, league is what they're going to do instead of it this time around, though. Exactly. I don't think I'll be having anything to do with it, that's for certain. A slurry, Tom, not water. I put slurry on this one before you appear tonight. I was almost set a watch by my dog, he's just appeared beside me at 9 o'clock is his supper time. Or thereabouts. I 
think lay crops are a thing in here at the moment, so we ain't got to worry about that. This game, probably that Deutz we're using earlier at the moment, I think. Not at the moment, Tom. This is the biggest tractor in the game. The Axiom 940 is the biggest, what we're using here. It's still time to add more. Remember, it's still early access and in development. It's not a fully finished game yet. <clears throat> uh, 627, that's one of the old uh, bug eyed ones, isn't it? Tom, from memory. First, the new Aries tractor is what class brought out. basically because those early class A's were actually in development by Renault before class bought them the 657s, 27s and all them if you speak to someone in the know they'll tell you that Renault had already got them designed ready to bring out before class bought the company No, they're not. I had the one of the last of the orange Aries tractors, what the local dealer sold. get this field finished probably where we leave it for tonight on here not quite a bit done tonight A couple of head and wrap ends at each end of the field. Oh, 
12,000 hours ain't doing too bad then for a tractor. Better check all them notifications before we finish though. So really adding up there now. And yeah, that's not too bad then. Surprised you didn't have to have a head gasket done on it, but that's unusual for those hours. Should have racked a few points up on here tonight, I think, even though we haven't done any quests, tasks, whatever you want to call them. Stress inducers, probably, if they involve helpers. So our only experience of a helper tonight didn't end very well. Yeah, I'm enjoying it still, 1174. If I wasn't enjoying it, I would have given up playing it by now. Certainly after last night, anyway. Sure, I've got more grey hairs after last night on there. Mm, it was funny. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, because I brought a broke. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think I should get a medal for last night. Yeah. Just not, during um, the stream, not after the stream. Yeah, not after the stream. Not after. What I said after the stream could definitely not be broadcast on a PG channel. Nope. You missed that bit, Dal. <laughs> that was in not done then, by then. Yeah. I had a few choice I, I, words about the helpers after I finished. <laughs> can imagine. Very descriptive and agricultural words. <laughs> Thing is, when this came out, there wasn't that many trees on the map, so the workers obviously worked well. Yeah. And obviously, with them adding stuff to it, they're just obviously eating everything. <laughs> and each other. It's mostly hitting each other was the problem, not everything else, wasn't it? Hmm. So 
So 27 notifications now. So we're racking them up. So there's a question <clears throat> is what is everyone else who's watching thinking of the game? What do you mean 1174? It's enjoyable watching the helpers wind me up on here to the point I want to go non PG and calm. That'd be a more accurate description. Well, I could go non PG, but it wouldn't end very well. Better not. Yeah, better not. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think your PC would thank you at all for this, GD. CPU will be like melting. Yeah. It will be on smoke. 29 notifications. I mean, this has even got <clears throat> multi train angle on here, hasn't it? Just follows the drill whichever way you go. So it curled around behind the drill there. Bits I've gone over twice of the soil is drier as well. Because now, if we look at the um, map or field description, this helps us do, do some weird bits for stretching at times. I believe it's is that one we want. Field 48 sowed, 100% wheat, 18% wetness, no fruit, illness coming soon, okay. So it needs fertilising, possibly, and deep loosening, whatever we do to do that, because I have to have a look through and see what we find for that. Alright, let's have a look and see what that's been clicking up in the corner here. Save game created, okay. New machine bought, rent. Baby steps. Okay, what's... We'll No, 115, purchase, 50, purchase. We're racking up some points. We really racked up some points on there tonight. More exercise, me, I don't think so. I think that's all these, them gone through. Yeah, 1150 XP points. When it even done a quest yet? During 31 kilometers with the tractors. Two hectares fertilized. 1.76 drills. 
reputation 1.39 with the sewage plant, so we can rack that up. 12 out of 20 vehicles, 20 out of 40 animals. I did call the save game broken when I created it tonight. Just in, in case anything went wrong, I thought I'd call it broken. No, that's not me in the picture for anyone asks. I'm much better looking. Don't say it, GD. <laughs> As he's the only one who's actually met me in there. <laughs> I dread to think what he could come out with in reply to that one. <laughs> Alright, we want to get this back up the yard anyway for tonight. We have to admit, dragging the dog sideways with a slurry tanker is an interesting occurrence tonight. That's definitely evidence of being broken on air. Which one, GD? I think the drill is deciding to do a little dance now. I wonder if you hit a car hard enough what happens. Try it. I just have. That's enough to make you want it, GD, I do know. To remember, we do need to put some maize in as well for the cattle. But there is a tractor mat forage halves as well, so it's not the end of the world to grow that on there. So, four of these vehicles here are leased. The brakes are good on this stuff because if you slam on it, it does lock up the skid. So what I see have we actually got in here? Steering console height. Nice, so we can move that up and down. And flip it backs and forwards. Windscreen wipers. doesn't open like it's supposed to, hazards, four-wheel drive, beacons, lights, mirrors again we can adjust, back window we know, but we'll have to try that and see if the noise increases how it did with the combine. Cabin lights. Interesting. Shut that door up. And that's where we'll leave it. So, for now, Microphone muted. Sound muted. I will say thank you for watching tonight and bearing with us again. Hopefully you're enjoying it.
I shall be back again tomorrow night. But for now, I'll pop a link to today's video in chat. So we have a map first look going out in Peterville tomorrow morning at 7 o'clock. But for now, I'll say thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed this stream, and I'll see you again in the next one. Goodbye for now.